Tēnātātou katoa, good evening. One of New Zealand's greatest athletes, Sir Murray Halberg, has died aged 89. Sir Murray won the 5,000 metres gold medal at the 1960 Olympics during one of our most important events in our sporting history, the fabled Golden Hour. Sir Murray and Sir Peter Snell both won gold medals on the track within one hour of each other at the Rome Olympics. Alex Chapman remembers a great athlete who went on to help others and become a great New Zealander. The 1960 Rome Olympics and Murray Halberg comfortably wins gold in the 5,000 metres, eight metres clear of his nearest rival. Halberg, hanging on. The daring plan he devised with coach Arthur Lydiard paid off. Halberg started the race trailing the pack, but with three laps still to go, he made his move, and from there all he had to do was hang on. Exhausted by the effort that took, Halberg collapsed in a heap at the finishing line. There to check he was OK was fellow runner Peter Snell, who'd also won gold that day. Halberg was part of the golden era of New Zealand running. He took up the sport after a rugby injury meant his left arm was severely withered. He became the country's first sub-four-minute miler and was awarded New Zealand Sportsman of the Year in 1958 after winning the gold medal in the three-mile event in that year's Empire Games. Olympic gold came two years later, but by 1964 his running career was over. Not that he made it official. Oh, if you look back to the records, I never retired. <laughs> Good on you. And the Olympic, the Olympic selectors haven't selected me again. So. <laughs> Halberg looked for something to fill the gap. That something became the Halberg Disability Foundation he set up in 1963. Whilst I'm proud and, uh, and it's complimentary that it that the trust and the foundation now bears my name. It's not, it's not me. It's what, it's what these people are about. It's what the foundation is about. The foundation set up the Halbergs as a fundraiser. Along the way, it became the country's premier sporting awards. But the true goal of the foundation was for everyone, regardless of their physical limitations, to have the same access to sport and recreation. We want that opportunity for all New Zealanders. It's, it's they're right. Sir Murray received an MBE in 1961, was knighted in 1988, and in 2003 he received the country's highest honour becoming one of only 20 members of the Order of New Zealand. But he confided that nobody called him Sir. Hey, you. <laughs> or as my family says, a dad or muzz or <laughs> silly old bugger. Come here, you know. Sir Murray was one of those rare people who followed up one successful career with another, from world-class runner to philanthropist. It was the latter that he considered his greatest achievement. As a young person, I, I aspired to be an Olympic champion, and uh, I thought maybe, maybe if the, gra the gods granted me that wish, that I would die a happy man. But I would think that the Helberg Trust is, is uh, would have to rank number one for me. Alex Chapman, New Sub.